another uh, cipher which is okay so virginia cipher is exactly same as caesar cipher the only difference is here we will use a phrase instead of a letter in caesar cipher we use one letter like d okay there is in virginia cipher we will use a bunch of letters or a phrase or a word right so it is actually nothing but multiple times you are applying caesar cipher with different keys okay so you can think of virginia cipher as caesar cipher which apply different key on different letters while encryption okay so a simple example could be this is a message a limerick pax loves anatomical now this is the key bench is the key now what you have to do is when you are enciphering the uh, the uh, message you have to shift a with b you have to shift l with e you have to shift i with n you have to shift m with c you have to shift e with h right in caesar cipher the entire message is shifted by one constant number okay but here different numbers are used to shift Uh, the letters right so again r will be shifted by b then e then n then c and n then h okay so this is how it works so when we shift a with b so what is b b is 2 uh, not 2 1 right a is 0 b is 1 so a will get converted into b similarly you have to shift l with e okay so e means 4 so l m n o p okay so after l you have to go fourth position should you have to replace it right so 1 2 3 4 so l is get shifted by e so we get p okay i will shifted by n m will be shifted by c so on and so forth okay so you just keep on repeating this bench 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 keep on writing it okay until you reach the last uh, letter of your plain text and you have to shift each number by a different number this is the overall idea of virginia cipher here is shifted by e so we will end up to some other letter where is uh, this l is shifted by c so we will end up to some other letter so on so forth right so we cannot actually correlate frequency of plain text and ciphers Text that much, that easily as we did in Caesar cipher, right? So this is how Virginia. This is the idea to uh, develop this Virginia cipher. So basically, in Virginia cipher, we have uh, a term called tabulo, and tabulo is used to encrypt and decrypt the uh, data. Okay. Now, what do you mean by tabulo? Tabulo uh, in tabulo. the column corresponding to the letter of key okay so we will have a table let's say bench bench is the key so you will make a table with the key in column okay and you have to put the letters in row okay, so a b c d you have this letters in row okay now you have to make this table so if uh, sorry if a is shifted by b what will be the answer b will be the answer if a is shifted by e what will be the answer e will be the answer if b is shifted by e what will be the answer okay maybe this is the answer something like that okay so you have to come up with this entire table and whenever you have to encrypt the letter okay so suppose you have the key b and you have to encrypt letter r so you just go down in b and you have to search for the letter r and whatever written in the cell you will uh, consider it as a cipher text corresponding to that letter okay so for example uh, the given table which is a small table a relevant part of the tabulo suppose key is b and we have the letter r so you just go down in b and uh, row you have to choose r whatever written in this cell s so s will become the cipher text corresponding to r at this location okay if key is h and your letter is l you just go down in h and 
this side in n and you will replace it with s okay so letter r can land up to s letter l can also land up to s it may be possible right so this is how we are somehow smoothing the uh, frequency distribution curve in case of uh, vigenier uh, uh, cipher okay